Hello movie lovers, Bob for Bob's Movie Review here, and I'd like to review for you a movie I just watched called Shooter. This one was provided to me for review by Paramount Home Entertainment. If you get a chance to check this one out, let me your thoughts down in the comment section below. I'll include more information below the links. First one, down in the description. So this is the 15th anniversary 4K Steelbook. So this movie's been out for 15 years, obviously. So it's not a new movie by any means. And it stars Mark Wahlberg. And I always kind of like Mark Wahlberg. Like he just, he's the guy who has a lot of charm and he can easily win over his audiences. Uh, regardless of the movie, I think, you know, he kind of just makes every character shine who he plays. And so in this one, he, I, I don't remember, he was some armed forces uh, sniper. I can't remember exactly uh, what it was, but he is on some kind of like, they call it a peacekeeping mission or something, and things go wrong and his partner is killed. And now he's moved back to the United States. And it's I don't, some, some years later, and he's just kind of living and hiding out and Danny Glover's character comes and he asks him, he says, someone's going to attempt to assassinate the president. We don't know who, we don't know how, we just know that it's going to be within the next two weeks and these are three possible uh, locations it could happen and you're the best sniper in the world and we want you to study it and figure out how you would do it so you could tell us so we can stop it. So he comes out of hiding to help stop the assassination attempt on the president and he kind of scouts out the locations and he says, okay, this is where it's going to happen. You know, this is when it's going to happen. This is how it's going to happen. And so they go and, and they're like, okay, we got teams in place. We're going to get them. We're going to stop them. And uh, they don't because it's actually a double cross. And uh, so they are trying to frame him for the attempted assassination of the president. And he, of course, has to go on the run and he has to prove um, his innocence and also uh, bring the real attempted assassin <laughs> whatever you want to call these guys bring them to justice so there's been a ton of movies made like this where it's like this guy who's like a super soldier who can never be stopped and there's some kind of government conspiracy and he gets caught up in it and blamed for it and he has to prove his innocence so in that way it's it's nothing new um the movie is interesting and i do like the story i think i liked it probably more the first time i saw it this is probably my second watching of it uh, so I don't think this one necessarily holds up as well, um, but it is definitely interesting. Michael Pena also in this one, um, you know, he's pretty good in it. I, th I think Michael Pena is pretty good. I don't know why he doesn't get in more movies, but I always enjoy his performances. So the movie to me is all right, above average for sure. So the 4K to me, I did watch this one in Dolby Vision. Uh, I thought it looked really good. Uh, there were there were some scenes where I thought maybe the details in the background were a bit blurry and, and not as sharp as I would have liked. Um, but I felt like the color and the shading and just kind of the lighting, the brightness, the darkness, it felt super realistic and the colors were like spot on. Like the colors looked so great and there were like scenes in the snow where like the, the brightness from the snow was like blinding me and I was like, you know what? When you're out in the snow, that's how it feels. Like you're getting blinded. And then like when they were in the shadows, like it just felt like just right and the colors were great. And for the most part, the picture quality was really clear. Um, and had some good detail in it. So I think this was actually a really good looking 4K. I definitely enjoyed the the video quality on this one. So I'm gonna give this one a three and a half out of five. Hope you did enjoy the video. If you haven't already, subscribe for more videos, to watch this videos, and I'll see you guys next time.